Hi, I'm Matt. I'm the host of the Royal Alliance UK podcast. I'm 30 years old from Bristol, England. I'm a chartered accountant. I'm a proud follower of Liverpool Football Club and a poker enthusiast and a metalhead. The reason I started following Detroit um, was about the start of 2009. Uh, part of the attraction was that they had the number one overall pick and our spirits love an underdog. Uh, other reasons though, I see Detroit as kind of emblematic of America as a whole and obviously the NFL is a very American sport. Detroit, the home of Motown and the auto industry, the things that I kind of regard as very typically American. It just spoke to me in a way that no other team did. My favourite line of all time ah, is so difficult to choose. Uh, I've gone through phases of loving different players at some points. Um, early on in my fandom, Z Cancer, later on, Golden Tate. But I'm going to be a bit boring and say that my favourite of all time is Matthew Stafford. Uh, he made a believer out of me for over a decade. Every time I was on the field, it felt like anything was possible. Um, Honourable mention to the greatest line of all time who's clearly Barry Sanders but I never saw him play while I followed the team and so Stafford gets the nod for me. My favourite moment as a Lions fan, there's only one answer here and it was watching them for the first time at Wembley for Lions at Falcons. Uh, Falcons led 20 nothing at half time, I felt like I've made a big mistake throughout the <laughs> six or seven years that I've been following them since. Uh, so before that, um, but the game ended with 21 straight points for Detroit. Uh, we missed a field goal at the end to, to win the game. It got pulled back for a false start. The crowd went absolutely wild when he missed the kick. And so where, from where I was, I couldn't hear what had happened. I just saw the, all of the Falcons team rush onto the field and then kind of gingerly go back. And the line went back five yards and 40 seconds later, I was the one shouting and screaming. And I know that the boys on the podcast have seen the video of me going absolutely mental. And believe me, it's, it's not pretty. In five years time, I see Brewer the Lions UK as a fundamental part of the Lions fabric on both sides of the pond. I want us to provide a space for fans from the US and the UK to connect. So regular social events in the UK to watch games, especially when they come over for Wembley, which I'm, you know, it can only happen one in every eight years with four teams coming over, but that's regular enough. And to have annual trips to the States to watch games, maybe one in Detroit and one in an away location. Um, I also, you know, it, the NFL is the fastest growing sport in the UK at the moment. So there's plenty of new fans coming to the sport. And we need to be in that zone of bringing new fans into the sport and to the Lions specifically. 